at 530, teachers in Broward County are getting a pay raise. It's after about seven months of negotiations. On average, teachers will receive an 11% increase in total compensation. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Nasha Sherman. And I'm Jim Barry. CBS News Miami's Anna McAllister joins us live from Cooper City High School with details on the agreement. And I'm sure teachers are pretty happy about this, Anna. Absolutely, Jim and Naja today marks a victory for Broward teachers and members of the Broward Teachers Union say many of the educators in this county have to work several jobs just to support themselves. And they say this pay increase is a step in the right direction. Thanks to the Broward County School Board 6 to 3 vote in favor of new contracts with the Broward Teachers Union, educators can expect a bump in their paychecks. This raise increases the base salary for our teachers who are the backbone of our organization. More than $175 million is being invested into teachers' compensation with hopes of retaining educators in the district. School district officials say about $19.6 million of federal funding will expire in the fall. It's very scary considering lowering enrollment. Uh, uh, facilities that are in need of repair and making sure that we compensate our staff so teaching actually gets done. The agreement states that teachers on a grandfathered salary schedule will receive a 3.65 percent increase. Teachers on a performance-based schedule will see a 3.42 percent to 4.56 percent increase in salary. And new teachers starting salary increases to $50,226. The cost of living has gravely um, impacted our educators. Our teachers are here wholeheartedly. They give a more than 100% commitment. They work after hours, they work long hours, they work weekends. Broward Teachers Union President Anna Fusco also pointing out the challenges teachers face every day while trying to invest in the future of students. Schools with measles, schools with mold, schools with broken air conditioning, bomb threats that happened that put our teachers and students in three hour outside conditions. That is commitment. And this pay increase is coming from state and stimulus dollars, and the school board tells us that they're going to work on other incentives to keep teachers here in the county. For now, reporting live from Cooper City High School, Anna McAllister, CBS News, Miami.